Hi everybody, this is Donnie Vaughn of the Marketing Twins. You can find us online at marketingtwins.com. Today's quick tutorial is going to show you how to change the tiles that you see here. Some people refer to them as custom tabs. We've even referred to them that way. This is in the new timeline format, the Marketing Twins page that you're looking at. So how do you change these? Now first off, let's talk about this one right here. This photos, this is Facebook's, uh, you can't change the location of this. This is set in stone and it is derived from the latest photo that you've placed in your uh, updates, in your news feed, if you will, your timeline, however you want to say it. But this photo here, after we posted that today, that photo shows up here. So keep that in mind if there are photos that you want to have that, you know, they have a nice look to them that get people's attention. It will also show up here on this top photos tile here. But what about these three here? Now, let's talk about these because not everybody has these. Uh, these are custom tiles that we've done. We are welcome, um, or we're excited about I saw the word welcome and I said it. We would love to help you create custom pages and these custom tiles here. So if you're interested in doing that, go to marketingtwins.com and you'll look on the side for the information how to differentiate your Facebook page. We think we can help you with that, so check that out. Go to marketingtwins.com to find that. But specifically on this, if you already have some custom tabs already set up, if you do not, what you're going to show are the, the likes, the probably a map, and maybe events or something like that here. But let's say you have one of these and you want to change it out. You see this little button over here on this tile has a number six. It tells you there's six additional tiles below this. We click on that and that reveals all these six different ones. One of those is the likes that I showed mentioned earlier. And then th these are some other different custom pages that we've created. Um, each of these uh, you can see, I'll click on this school marketing one. This is a, a service that we're offering now to help with uh, school private school marketing. And so we drive people directly to that so they can see directly into our yourschoolmarketing.com page. If you were to click on the uh, gallery, you'll see some more information there. And these are great custom tabs that you can put a lot of good information and you'll see that that's there. So how do you go about changing those? And so let me show you real quickly how to do that. Let's say that I'm going to reveal all those. Let's say I want to put Pinterest up here instead of seven steps or instead of something else. And since our seven steps kind of goes with our custom timeline cover, you have the one, two, three, four, one, I got ahead of myself, one, two, three, four, five, six, because we want to drive people to the like button and then seven here so it's kind of a creative way of using that we won't mess with that one but let's change this just change this particular one out and today let's focus on Pinterest so how do we change this out for Pinterest real simple all you simply need to do is go over here to your hover over you have to be the admin to the page I should say that just to make sure click on the pencil that shows up there and up here it says swap position with and I can select either the ones that they already have here, events of likes, or I can select one of the ones that we've done, which in this case is the consulting. So I'll swap that, and voila, you see what happens. It's, there's, no, there's nothing to save. It just automatically does it, and that's what's done. If I want to go back and switch them back, all I have to do is do that, and it switches them back. So that's a way, if there are certain things that you want to highlight, maybe it's an event, Maybe it is a custom page like this, a custom tile. Uh, I mean, you want to focus on that. You can swap that out and uh, put that up there. It's real easy. Hopefully you found that to be helpful. If you have any other questions, contact us at marketingtwins.com.